Hello and welcome back to the Garion Tabletop, I am Garion Reva, this is episode 3 of Stacklands with this pre-recorded, post-recorded intro. That one. Makes you more efficient. Ah, I bet that's like, um, armour. So I think this one is the slingshot, yep. Good, brilliant. I've moved my food over to that side. Because that's sort of where all my food stuff is anyway, and this way I can sort of tuck this into the corner. Try and make better use of my space instead of just sticking to the corners and then ending up having it all smushed together anyway. I feel I've been very poor lately, so let's try and fix that. If I get like two more iron mines, wood, stone, and villager. Wood, stone, and villagers. And because iron, uh, iron ore seems like a brilliant source of money. So if I just have, I mean, I've admittedly I've got 19 stone in here. So if I just pop this down here and just pop a load of that out and then sell all of this, that helps. There, two more iron mines. So if I stick them like here and here, just have two more people mining iron and it's not going to be a f oh it's not going to be as fast because they need pickaxes. Hmm. I don't know if I've got the food capacity to get more people. I'm really paranoid about running out of food again. I feel that will completely scupper me. Don't know what happens if all my people die. I assume I lose. All right. I don't think I need rabbits, so I'm going to get rid of them. They're just like poop is something else to sell, but it's so low value and I don't have an actual use for it yet, so I, I'm just better off getting rid. Chickens are actually useful though. And rabbit hats? I was thinking about this. Minus health but higher attack speed and defense. They're good for archers who aren't going to be theoretically hit, maybe? I don't know, I'm just going to give them to them, whatever. Actually, not the wizard because he's, he's flimsy enough as it is. Is he? Oh no, he's got 15 health. Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, I have 50 food. Done. Brilliant. Ooh. Is that more efficient? I just put two um, wood into the sawmill. Ah, it'd be great if it was more efficient than... Uh... It is! It's more efficient. It only uses two instead of three. Fantastic. Two plank, two wood, iron bar. Two plank, two wood, iron bar. Villager, to make a second animal pen. Animal pen, brilliant. So now I'm going to start breeding chickens. So if I uh, combine a chicken and an egg, it the chicken will brood. Can I do that in there as well? I can, I could do it while it's on the thing. That's handy actually, so I think I'll just stack that on there and just have a couple of eggs and maybe it'll do two at once, I don't know, we'll find out. 86 coins, let's get some armory stuff. Let's get a load of armory, as much as I can afford. That's all I can afford. What have we got? A bear! Axe! Oh, axe, fantastic! Iron bar, stick and wood. We do, we, yeah, we have a bear, soft but dangerous. Oh no, that doesn't look good to fight. Everybody? Swarm the bloody thing. Yeah, get it. Okay, well, it seems that it can just fight anywhere. It doesn't have to be, like, opposite it. Okay, sorry, Bear. We're just taking a food break. Give us a minute. All right. Uh, that wasn't too bad. Uh, skeleton. Wooden shield. Basic defense against hard blows. I feel like I shouldn't send people away until I've unpacked all of these because I feel there's going to be like one enemy per thing. Kill him! Kill that skeleton, yeah! Oh wow, he dropped a wooden shield! Yeah, wooden shield, yeah, I already know that stuff, thanks. Thanks, skeleton. Hard defense, so presumably that is also something I can- yep, that's a, an armor one. Yeah, it's always the second one. Slime. Three small slimes and a trench coat. That's a Slime Rancher reference. That's got to be a Slime Rancher reference. To Bob. Fishing rod. Give it to a villager to turn them into a fisher. Rope. Don't know what rope is. Fight the slime. 
That was okay. Yeah, no, it did turn into three small slimes. It warned me, and I didn't believe it. Coin, coin, magic dust. Oh, very nice. Looks like glitter. That's the first magic dust I found, even though I've known about it for ages. Uh, club. And this one, spiked plank for tough construction workers. Wow, that's that's terrible. Uh, there's going to be an enemy, a bear. Oh, wow, it actually shows. Very effective, very effective, very effective. So what if I leave him out of the fight? And now? Can I just, like, drop him in and out? This seems quite... Okay. I might be able to just, like, drop him in and out of the fight as required to best protect himself. And the last one is iron ore. And a bear again. Yeah, take him out of the fight. Now back into the fight. Now back out of the fight. Oh, the bear turned into poop. I don't know that I need these cows anymore. I kind of feel like it might be better for me to lean further into the farms and just surround a mess hall in farms. Because that would probably produce enough, but I suppose it depends on how many people I've got. Yeah, it seems these high-end ones always have enemies in. Because that's a lot of enemies. Ordering structure. I suppose that's expensive, but the idea is it's always safe. Uh, it seems these have stopped brooding and it seems they're just producing them now. Alright, I'm just going to brood them outside of the pen. Because I don't think it's working properly. I was hoping to, like, get them to brood multiple at once, but I don't think that's how it works. And I've got a load of spare carrots, so sell all of those. I don't know that I need all these eggs, actually. Alright, I'm just going to just gonna put the chickens in there and just sell the eggs. See how I get on with that. Temple. Five plank, five brick, three iron, and a villager. I can probably afford that. I've got tons of wood now. Can I stack up multiple things of these and will it do them in succession? I guess I'll find out after I feed everybody. Eat all of this milk and, f and meat. Seems like it's going to. Is it going to do like... Oh, is it going to do like two loads at once? It did not, but that's still cool. What about if I put two loads of iron ore and stuff in there. Is that going to do two at once? Not two at once, but is it going to be able to do that sequentially? It is. Fantastic. I'm going to have this temple in no time. Three iron bars and three villagers. So I'm going to have to borrow you to make a temple. I assume this is a really big deal because that's using a lot of materials, more than anything I've built before. Two stone, two iron bars, and two villagers to produce two more warehouses as well. Beautiful. There goes my concern about uh, running out of space. Another strange portal. Reach moon 36. So that's all longevity done as well. So I've done longevity, construction, ways and means, potluck, and power and skill. I just haven't discovered anything or got stronger at all. Bloody hell. Two iron bar and two brick. I can probably do that actually. I think I'd rather face whatever comes out than go in and possibly lose. Two iron bar, two brick. And a villager. Uh, it's probably not worth doing now because it's not going to get done before the attack comes, but I'll try. We've got a feral cat, which probably has rabies. A rat, an elf, does not work for Santa Claus anymore. Any more being the operative uh, term there. Alright, um... Yeah, I'm gonna have to pull those three out of there. I need to... I need to fight. Look at the feral cat! One down. The elf has only just joined the fight. Too little too late, matey. All your mates is his deads. Another quiver, good. Uh, who could do with that then? Who else has the slingshot? You do, and you do. Cool. I have a fully equipped guy. Boom! Build a smithy. A building used for creating better weapons. So I assume some things, like the higher end ones, apparently not the sword, 
but some things are going to need um equip an archer with a quiver i don't have archery i don't have bows uh but yeah presumably they're going to need a smithy as a construction piece let's get another thing from the university as i have a load of coins and i don't want to fight more things right now Dustbin allows you to get rid of cards you don't want anymore. Oh, like the corpse. I can finally bin the corpse, although he kind of feels like part of the family. Oh, goop. Oh. Don't have any goop. I got rid of the goop because I didn't think the goop was useful. Two more rabbits, but I got another soil, which I was hoping for. And nothing good in there. Because I have got only two farms and uh, five gardens. So I could do with another uh, four soil, really. I think I will just kill off these rabbits, though. The ones I'm getting from this, because I don't need rabbits, they just produce poop, and so far I've not found a use for that. Ooh, but I will hold on to the key, because that seems useful now. I forgot that I used to get keys. And a rabbit hat, which I will hold on to as well. Second key. Interesting that I can use the meat in the smithy. What does that do? Nothing? So it's probably for a combination. I'm going to kill off one of the chickens as well. I do not need it right now. Oh! I can use the key on someone, or I can use him on a key. No, doesn't do anything. Oh, I got a foil wood. Worth uh, five instead of one. <laughs> That's a nice touch. A rat. Oh, build a temple. Brilliant. That's done now. Where is it? There. Ooh, an important place of worship and needs a mysterious artifact. Stick that in there. The temple was brought to the goblet. Wait a minute. Okay. I don't like that that's a ritual. I kind of feel like that's going to summon something, so I'm going to wait. Two brick, two plank, and a villager. I must have got like 10 bloody 20 Humble Beginnings packs. I fought like five rats, killed three or four rabbits. No more soil. I had a single soil from the entire bloody set. Crazy odds. But a new farm. Uh, I should work out what I'm going for because at the moment I'm just sort of spinning in the spot. What I should do is I should get another couple of people. I've got their farms for it now. So a wizard and a militia. I only have the one house, because I sold the others a while ago. Uh, wizard and militia to get a new baby. And I can just start building up my forces and, yeah, raise an army. Go in and see the, the witch. A forest amulet. Magic dust. Heal, feel the healing power of nature. Gold bars. So I haven't seen gold. I haven't seen a source of, of magic dust yet. And a smithy. Oh, right. Yeah, of course, you produce it in the smithy. I was just saying about how I expected there would be things like that. Kill the skeleton. Morning star. Minus attack speed plus. The thing is, none of these seem particularly better than the others. Because it's a lot of numbers and a lot of, like, hit chance and so on. It, it doesn't seem particularly specific about what is and isn't good. Blunderbuss. Wow. <laughs> okay. Gold bar, iron bar, plank, flint, and smithy. Damn. Ooh. I think he got poisoned. Magic dust. Kill the demon! Kill the demon! Presumably. I'm just going to go out on a limb here and say that's the demon from the ritual. Yikes! Give me some soil. Nope. So oh, yeah. I thought that was three soil. That would have been good. Alright, kill off the one rat that came out of it. Thank you. So I should be perfectly fine with just the carrots. And a little bit of milk, apparently. Thirteen cards too many. Oh yeah, I suppose I've got a load of iron ore, haven't I? Made a nice load of profit though, that's pretty good. Is that a foil rabbit? Uh, It might be worth keeping a foil rabbit. Do they all have that expression? I didn't think the others had that expression, but alright. Okay, maybe I didn't look too closely. I've got a key. 
but still just the one bloody soil. I definitely need a second house. I need to start uh, reproducing more quickly. I want to build an army and take on that witch in her own turf. Another farm, and I will... Um, yeah, these have all just started again. So I'm going to start swapping these out. Yay, a new villager at last. Have a morning star. Ooh. Wow. He looks like, uh, what's his name, Stretch Armstrong? And now he gets to stretch his arms. No, I'm not going to make that joke. Another house. Good. Wizard. Baby. And another baby. Brilliant. We are on the up. Oh, actually, I have an idea. If I take that, so we have uh, five, 10 stone in a chest. If I take that, so we have 10 wood in a chest. And then I shifty stuff round a bit. So I'll stick the stone and wood down here. And I'm thinking this way I can have the uh, sto the, the brickyard and the sawmill constantly produced because I'm, I'm going over my limit uh, quite consistently again and I think it's because I've got all of this stone and wood but also all of this um ooh, no, that doesn't go there that goes there but also all of this other stuff so I figure if I start like automatically doubling this stuff up uh, then I can just make a load of money on the side another day or another moon rather and hopefully oh three too many uh I'll sell three stone. Oh, a rare portal. All right, I might, I might be ready for this. Everybody gathered. In we go, and we'll see if we all die off. If we do die off, we've got a miner and two babies. Oh, so you're back for more. Uh, merman, two mosquitoes, two feral cats, and a giant snail. Okay, that doesn't seem too bad. What's the merman's deal? He's got legs. Half man, half mer. Right. Ah, oh, look, there's little icons. So that shows that he's a ranged attack. Uh, very effective, not effective. So if I shifty them... Yeah, they can only attack the two next to them. Okay, what about that? Very effective against him. Alright, shift those rounds so that he's very effective against the one with higher health. Alright, begin. Giving them the best chance they can have, I think. Yeah, strategy, blowpipe. Still need an archer, like a bow. Ooh. You've defeated my minions, but I have plenty more. Uh, no, I'm gonna fight again. Dark elf, orc wizard, ent and merman. Oh, okay, they are getting quite strong. I think that's the best I can do. I may lose some people here. Oh, we are doing very little back to them. Oh, no. I definitely need to strengthen up. Like we, We're chipping away at them. The Orc, orc Wizard's Den dropped some magic dust. Oh, some goop. Good. I'm so glad I got some goop. Oh. We're on the verge of... Oh, a magic staff that looks like Saruman's staff. It looks exactly like Saruman's staff. Oh, I can't believe we've done this. Nothing could possibly go wrong now. You've defeated my minions. Flee. Flee. Oh, I'm surprised we survived that. What did we get? Uh, an idea magic staff. Magic staff, wood and smithy. Oh, sorry. Magic dust, wood and smithy. Magic Staff, uh, so that seems to just be an upgrade. <coughs> Mr. Wizard, I'll take that and I'll give you that. You're Mega Wizard now. Uh, plank, sure. Two more Magic Dust. Some Goop, which I need to make a bin. Some Milk, a Blow Dart, and some more Milk. So the Blow Dart, blow as hard as you can. 10% chance to poison. Okay. I don't know if that's any good. Uh, villager, iron bar, and goop to produce a dustbin. Oh yeah, I should make that axe. I could 
I could totally just re-equip people. I was thinking, oh, I need to keep everyone equipped with uh, me uh, like weapons just in case we get attacked. I could just bloody swap them over. Why did I not think of this? Iron bar, stick and wood. Another pickaxe. And a... Oh, a dustbin allows you to get rid of cards you don't want anymore. Okay, sure. Um, I'm just going to put that over here next to the temple. If I put the carrots next to the mess hall, then hopefully uh, it'll sort of... Well, I mean, it will. It'll use up all of the milk, which is less efficient, so it's better to use that first. Pickaxe. So, uh, quarryman, hand me your sword and take thine pickaxe in hand. And, and take thine pickaxe in hand, yes. Backeth to work. And an axe. The swordsman. I'll take that, you take that. He is totally naked. He is 100% naked, apart from the, the hat. Okie dokie. 